looking we're looking good but first let's take a sip of coffee iced uh, what is this espresso no milk mm. with four ice cubes exactly how i like it welcome to this uh, video if you're new here my name is uh, helen if you're not uh, new welcome back to the channel so today i'm going to talk about shoes i love talking about shoes I love fashion hauls, I love outfits and styling, but shoes, they, they really have, you know, a sweet little uh, spot uh, in, in my heart. Let me just put the camera a little bit down because I'm wearing shorts and you will be seeing my, my legs. Oh, maybe like that. It's one warm uh, day, but it's always warm uh, in the flat, in all uh, honesty. No matter what the weather is outside, it's always, uh, warm in here, hence the shorts. Uh, La neige on the lips, just to soften soften them up a little bit. I have I just taken a shower. I did my skincare routine. I don't have any makeup uh, on because I think that when I'm not working and I don't have to go out, I really want uh, my skin to breathe and just you know be on its own. Even though I have applied um, a face cream, the, um, the Cetaphil one, soft lotion, and I do find it quite greasy in the summer for some reason. Uh, so yeah, I just feel a little bit too greasy, but that's fine. I didn't want to remove it and apply a different night cream. Next up, uh, I have my Summer Fridays lip oil. I mean, I've barely used it in, and some of it is almost gone. I don't know how it happens but what i have to say about this lip oil i feel that the product inside this uh, jar is not a lot for the price that they charge and this wand is not practical at all i love the packaging like that i love the color it's very subtle this one is the blush dreams yeah i don't think this is the best lip oil in the market but kind of like it. I don't think I will uh, buy this uh, again though. I need to find some uh, new, some different uh, lip oils for when um, this finishes. So today we're talking about uh, summer shoes and I have a, a nice little unboxing to do for you from Netta Porte. So when it comes, let me just do this. <laughs> I should have brought uh, my fan actually. Um, when we're talking about shoes, summer shoes, I'm following a very minimalistic route. The last two years, I'm, um, I have adopted the capsule wardrobe, not when it comes to clothing, but also shoes and accessories. So less is more, uh, the more minimalistic, the better uh, for me. And uh, for my summer shoes, I want them as simple as possible, as comfortable as possible. And I don't want to have a plethora of uh, shoes. Uh, and the ones that I have, I want them to um, be able to be worn with pretty much every single outfit I can put uh, together. So I have four uh, pairs that I've ordered from Netta Porte. They were all on sale. Yay! I love buying shoes on sale because you get the most uh, for your money and you know you can allow yourself to buy not just one pair but maybe two uh, you know and just before I start uh, showing you what's in these uh, boxes um, just on top of my head I don't have the shoes um, here because you know they are dirty and I don't want to be uh, touching but I will ensure to include some either photos or clips just so you have a, a visual these are the summer shoes that I wear on repeat. And I'm gonna start first with a, a pair of ancient Greek sandals because, you know, I'm Greek uh, after all, and I love this uh, Greek uh, brand. Uh, they're very minimalistic. I don't like all of their styles, um, but the ones that I've purchased, again, from Netta Porte actually, many, many years ago, and I love the little gold detail uh, that they have. Um, and i've been wearing them every single summer this is not a morning shoe for me 
simple uh, simply because um, it has uh, the detail that it has and the gold color that it has. I wear it towards the evening, afternoon, and I have even worn uh, these uh, shoes to a summer wedding by the beach uh, with just a long uh, dress. I think they're very, very uh, nice. They're not very comfortable because the sole of, um, of the shoe is um, it's like wooden. So if I, if I wear them for too long, then my, uh, my feet get a little bit dry and hard, if you know what I mean. Uh, but nevertheless, I really like uh, these shoes. And I've, as I said, I've had them for so many years and every single summer I just bring them out and I enjoy them with so many outfits. Next up, we have, of course, my Birkenstocks. In the summer, I'm wearing my Arizonas. Uh, when it is super hot, of course, without socks. But like this morning that I went to the gym, I had to uh, put on some socks because my, my feet were <laughs> freezing. Uh, but of course, the British summer is not your typical summer. If you know, uh, you know. But bigger stocks, I mean, you can't go wrong. For me, they're very, very comfortable. I don't find them true to size. My normal size is 36, but in Berks I'm 35, so I hold size uh, smaller uh, but they are very very comfortable I wanted to get them in the taupe color uh, but no matter how hard I've uh, looked at Harrods where I work and other retailers I cannot find the style of Arizona that I want in my very very small uh, size so hence I've ordered all of this just you know uh, to bring something new uh, to my wardrobe so we've got these two shoes and then i always um wear and love anything handmade from you know maybe some trips some holidays that you've uh, taken for example i have two pairs of these minor Keenan, um sandals they are in leather i've uh, purchased them ages ago over seven years ago in Minorca and I still have them. Fair enough because uh, the top layer is in suede and suede is a little bit sensitive um, as a material, as a fabric. Uh, they look a little bit old, they have been worn out, they are a little bit dirty but I, mean, I, still, I still wear them and they match every outfit uh, I can put uh, together and sometimes I even wear them you know in the evening going out or you're on holiday even if you wear something pretty a dress or something like that I personally I want to uh, be wearing a pair of sandals that it is super super comfortable so I really like uh, these uh, these two and uh, another style is this brand again I purchased it on um, Net-a-Porter ages ago Casa de Vera is the brand, if I'm uh, correct, and they are handmade uh, as well. They are in fabric, they're, they're true to size, I'm 36 in, uh, in these ones, and they're so soft and gentle to my feet, I can wear these shoes all day long. And when I'm talking about summer shoes, for me the prerequisite is the shoes need to be open. Uh, when it is summer, I really want my feet to breathe and I think it's essential for me um, to have an open toe, an openness in general situation uh, there. Of course, if it starts raining, I'm gonna wear, you know, a pair of sneakers or something closed, something closed in leather, but as a general rule for summer, I want open shoes and my feet to be you know, to have the freedom that uh, they want and to uh, breathe. So I'm gonna, so that's the shoes that I've been wearing uh, on rotation um, uh, lately. Of course, I'm wearing some closed ones here in uh, London, like my Venetian um, slippers, but I'm not gonna uh, mention any shoes like this in uh, this uh, video. Uh, in this video, I just want to highlight comfortable and um, nice, stylish, uh, sandals for your capsule wardrobe if this is the aesthetic that uh, you like <laughs> okay I think I'm gonna open this envelope because I want to see the styles that I have so three pairs are from a 
favorite Australian brand of mine. This is the first time I purchased and this brand is called A. Emery, if I pronounce it correctly, and the shoes run quite big. So the brand is not true to size. If you are size, I, I am a size 36, so I went down a size 35 and they all fitted like a glove. One sec, because I received a message from my husband. Let me check it out. <laughs> so funny. He sent me a link from Marie Claire um, on a capsule wardrobe article. I love him. So uh, let's have another sip of coffee. Mm. This is so good and uh, strong. So A. Emery, three pairs of shoes. And the other one, uh, it is from the brand Porte and a pair. Uh, in collaboration with the Frankie shop. I'm going to start with this uh, pair. I think it's from an old-ish collection, but it doesn't matter uh, because I really like uh, the style. And this one as well, guys, one size smaller. 36 would have been quite huge uh, for me. The box came a little bit worn out. But this uh, it's fine. The shoes are to die for. They remind me a style that A. Emery has and wasn't available in my size on net -Porte. So how lucky uh, was I to find these ones? Let me just bring them up and close so you can see a little bit better. So voila, we have this for the big toe and then we have a beautiful little X all in leather and it ties uh, like that. I really like the bottom of uh, the shoe so it's super clean. I uh, haven't worn them. It is 100% calf leather and you can smell beautiful uh, leather. I like the fact that it reminds me of Birkenstocks so once you try them on, literally your feet are sinking into this beautiful uh, shoe. Uh, does this have a name? No, it doesn't have a name. So this is uh, the sandals. I'm keeping them. They fitted like a glove. They were very, very uh, comfortable. And uh, here you have a sticker detail so you can have it as loose as you want or as tight as you wish. They are very, very comfortable. And as I said, they remind me of, uh, of a pair of A. Emery and the, the raw sandals as well, the whole uh, vibe. So all time uh, classic, as I said, this is from a previous collection, but I think the style is just timeless and classic and it is perfect for that capsule wardrobe aesthetic that I think we all love uh, here uh, in, uh, in uh, this uh, community. So now let's start with a uh, Emery. So I don't know which one is this. Oh, this is a beautiful one. I'm gonna keep it for last. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it for last. So next up, I'm gonna show you the Nolan Sienna. Let's see. I love the boxes that they have. I love the fact that they are quite slim uh, because sometimes you know brands have really huge uh, boxes and it's not very practical so here you can see the brand all of the pairs of shoes came with shoe bags which is amazing because I love shoe bags and I use them so much especially when I'm traveling because I want to uh, protect my shoes so here are the shoe bags that I was telling you about and I love the fact that they are individual. Yeah, amazing. I really like uh, this uh, detail. So inside we have just black tissue uh, paper and this is the shoe. First of all, I mean, how minimalistic, how simple and beautiful this is. I'm gonna come a little bit closer so you can see all the detail, uh, details in case you're interested in uh, the shoes. They are in leather and the leather is super soft. So this is, these are like gladiator sandals. I've never 
purchased a pair like this where you have to tie this around your leg I was a little bit skeptical because I don't know how comfortable this would be and I was wondering is this gonna be too tight you know too uncomfortable around my leg I have to say that the leather this this strap is super super soft and when you tie it around your leg it doesn't hurt and it does stay there however the whole vibe of this sandal was a little uncomfortable for me and when I compared it to the other pairs that I got I felt that this effect wasn't as secure as the other options that I had so even though I loved the color it's so beautiful I don't have something in this uh, color uh, these are going back to net a to find to find a different uh, home because this was not uh, for me so next a emery pair of sandals these are in black the vive sandals i really like how they pack everything with the little net a uh, ribbon i have to say that net a and matches are my favorite online fashion retailers there they offer amazing service they have beautiful uh, brands and i ordered these four pairs of shoes and they came the next day so within 24 hours i had my purchase and i didn't have to pay extra for next day delivery i even uh, i opted for the option where i didn't pay anything and it takes a few working days but they arrived within 24 hours i mean amazing so again we have the individual um shoe um what's the name shoe bags protecting uh bags um and then you they have this little detail where you can secure um the bag as well same packaging as before and these sandals i have to say when i sold them on sale i fell i fell in love i've um i had read quite a few reviews so as to understand that you should go a size smaller in a emery because they run quite big and i had high expectation of the vive sandal i'm going to show it to you uh, now so look how beautiful it is in leather this bit here so cushiony and soft so we have one thin strap not too thin not thick at all and then we have this detail here where it goes around your ankle once and that's it but let me tell you that this i could not close this it felt that the leather strap here was too short and my ankles i mean they're not chubby they are normal i would say so i could not close it the size here was perfect 35 uh, a little bit tight here as if i mean i think if you have chunkier toes this is a little bit too small can you see uh but but when i tried them on i thought mm, you know maybe they will give it and then i went to close the strap and there was not enough material so i'm really disappointed i don't think this is an issue with the size because size 36 would be too long and big i don't know if it would have longer strap i doubt it but this is such a shame because the vive sandal is the ultimate capsule wardrobe minimalistic sandal look how small it is can you see uh sandal and it has like one centimeter uh, heel and again i like the detail here so they were not slippery at all when i tried them uh, at home uh, so i was really disappointed because i really wanted to keep uh, these uh, sandals but sadly they will be going uh, back to net porte and the last pair of sandals again a emery by the way this brand also does clothes uh which is yeah interesting 
I really like this stuff. In general, I love Australian labels. I have this je ne sais quoi kind of vibe in their design and they they just feel differently. By the way, today I'm wearing uh, an Australian brand. This linen top is a little bit uh, warm, I have to say, though it's quite thick. Uh, it is from, uh, what's the brand? Assembly Label. So this is a brand that I discovered when I was in Australia earlier uh, this uh, year. So it's a beautiful black linen uh, top, uh, just with a few buttons. And you can see uh, the sleeves are almost covering uh, this part. Very, very, very comfortable. And I've just paired them so as to have a two-piece uh, set with my linen shorts from H&M. So the shorts are quite affordable. This is not too bad price-wise. I think it's a mid-range uh, brand. Check them out. Uh, check them out. They're really, really good. So same situation here. Okay, so here the, the tissue is white. Maybe because the shoes are not dark. Let me show you the color, which is amazing. My wardrobe was really missing something like that to wear with lighter color clothes. I do have quite a lot of lighter uh, clothes, dresses uh, for, um, for the summer. And I didn't have a sandal other than my ancient Greek sandals that I mentioned at the beginning of the video. So look at this beige, but also buttery yellow uh, color. How beautiful is this? How beautiful. And I love this. I think it's quite sexy, you know, to have your big toe here and the rest of the toes here. And you can see the design is very chic very elegant, uh, very modern. And the important thing is that your toes are not sticking out. Your toes completely fit into the base of the sandal. So there's no toes sticking out as if there's not enough uh, space. I really, really like it. And even though this detail here when I saw it, I have to say, it looked a little bit awkward and I was already scared from the Vive sandal. I thought, this is not gonna close. This is this is not enough. The strap is not uh, long, but no, it fitted like a glove. It just secured my uh, feet so much. And as I was walking, uh, I felt that the shoe was very secure. So you can see that this part of the shoe is like open. It's so beautiful, such a clever, uh, design and again we have the same uh, detail here it's not slippery at all my ancient Greek sandals are a little bit uh, slippery uh, by the way it's all in leather and here we have like a goldish detail but it's not too flashy and here you can see the tan beautiful color so uh, summary for you know for your whites for your uh, any other uh, uh, color uh, i mean it also goes beautifully with just a black uh, outfit but you know everyone has a lot of black shoes uh, anyway so these were the shoes the sandals rather that i ordered from netta porte great prices check them out delivery was super super uh, quick and i'm going to organize uh, the return they have provided a paperwork sticker as well so i will keep two pairs uh, the very first that I showed you from the Frankie shop and Perry and Porte. So I think I've got a nice situation here because I'm keeping this classy, uh, chunky, uh, but chic black leather sandal. And then I want, I have something in off-white, lighter color for slightly more feminine, more sophisticated, elegant um, outfits for the summer both in leather and really, really good price points, if uh, you ask me. Let me know your thoughts about the sandals. Let me know what are your favorite summer shoes to wear. Uh, do you go for comfort or uh, do you wear high heels in the summer? I mean, I do have some sandals with heels. I didn't want to feature them in this video because I just wanted to show you and discuss about flat shoes flat sandals, really simple and um, less is more kind of vibe. 
Uh, of course, when you go out in the evening, if you found that you're wearing a nice linen dress, you can always wear something with a heel. But I think a simple, elegant sandal like this it also looks uh, fine. When I was younger, I always wanted to make an effort to wear high heels when I was going somewhere special. But these days, I'm a little bit more laid back. Uh, I do feel that this sandal is slightly dressier, if I can say uh, so. But at the same time, I could wear this in the morning with a pair of jeans and a linen uh, shirt to go out um, and about. So I think multifunctional, uh, good quality uh, shoes and comfortable um, as well is the key for my capsule wardrobe when it comes to summer sandals. Uh, thank you so much for uh, watching this uh, video thus uh, far. I uh, hope I'll see you in my next one. From me guys, a big kiss to all of you. Bye bye.